Hello everyone! My name is March. You can call me March. Wait, no, that's the opposite of what I normally say. Shoot. Alright, give me a break. It's been like two weeks since I last recorded. Um, but I'm really excited to jump in today. I'm like super duper excited because we're playing more Strawberry Jam. And I cannot wait. Cannot wait to see what kind of levels we're going to encounter today. Some people in the comments have been really hyping up a couple of them. So maybe I'll get to see some today. All right, well, now that I've loved my own intro, let's go find a level to play. Like I said, it's been about two weeks since I last played Celeste, and I'm happy to report that my little break has probably done me well. After all that neutral jumping from the last episode, I started to develop a weird, like, twitch in my left hand, so I definitely needed the break. No, wait, I've been this way before. This does not lead to a level, uh, as is becoming the trend. Finding levels is hard. But I found a new bench. <laughs> that accounts for something. There's a bunch of boxes there. Uh, not a level. Is that looks like a level though? All right, I have found my first level, and oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. I love this rain. Oh, I'm excited for whatever this is. Uh, this one's called Tree Hive. An intermediate level by Skeleton and Earthwise. Cool, let's hop on in. Ooh. Ooh, I like this music. Looks like we have another level of Dream Box. So, what did that just do? Does this one bounce? Did I do that or does it just bounce you back? Okay, so these dream blocks will bounce you back. That's rather cool. Oh, and we're going inside like a bee's hive, like a nest with all this honey. Is it sticky? Well, it's not more bouncy and it's not more sticky than I would have thought. So if this is gonna bounce me, does that mean this ping pongs me? It does. Ooh, that's cool. And then what do you do? Oh, you do that. Uh, okay, I obviously want to make this go back down because I don't want the spikes to be a problem. <gasps> and the lava's all honey. Wait, no, I did that wrong again. <laughs> I did that backward. Well, I, sorry, I have to just like stand here for a second and just kind of gush about this. This is so cool looking. Oh, like visually, I don't know. This might be like one of my favorite levels so far. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of very cool levels. And all of them have been really neat in their own ways up to this point. But like, oh my gosh, it's got all this stuff. It's got gentle rain, it's got really fun music, it's got a great color palette, it involves honey. These are all the things I love. And all it's missing is bread. What happened? Again! Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> Right? <laughs> and now this like spiky block isn't in the way, so that's probably good for everyone involved. Uh, there's a platform there that I definitely want to investigate. And that is not the way. That is also not the way. What is the way? Like that? Like that. Wait, did I want to do this? Is this the right way to go? <laughs> I thought this would be the not right way to go. Once again, I'm worried I'm going to miss stuff, but I guess if I have to play this level again to go look for the strawberries, it's not a big deal. Ow! <laughs> oh, whoops. Ah, why did it go down? <laughs> Alright, time to get serious. I guess. Right? Okay, good. Um, there's definitely a secret up there. So that will be the first strawberry I find at this level, hopefully. <laughs> there we are! Finally, a strawberry- okay. Alright, there's our strawberry. <laughs> and as I just learned, these green things are our spikes. 
every single time the palette changes, I have to retrain my brain. Uh, and we've got a lot of sort of this action where we do that, except better. I need to get a little higher with that entry. It's not high enough. Okay, new plan. No, no, new plan. So if I do this, now that, okay. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. What happened? Do over. Except that's an issue. Wait, what do I do there? Oh, but wait. Oh no, I'm so lost. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm supposed to do. This. Then I do this. Then when I do that. Yes, okay. All that pack rat down the bun barrow is finally paying off. That was really scary. <laughs> so if I go up again, that's gonna move this block. All right, be kind. So you are not kind. So this time, something like that, maybe? And then, oh, I don't know, like this? And then hope? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Oh, what a really cool area. And back into the hive. Oh yeah, they're right. That's how the hive works. Uh, help? <laughs> Why wouldn't you help? I need to dash into something. Oh, right. That's how the hive works. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. I... 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 Oh, God. <laughs> Alright, Hive, I've seen your tricks. I know what you're up to. Probably. Did I want you to do that? Did, did I want you to go down there? How, uh, there might be more tricks. Okay, we've got quite a little puzzle box here. And as ever... I could sit here deciphering it, but that feels boring, so I'm just gonna plow ahead. Well, this is a long room. Where am I going? Right here? Did I miss something down there? <laughs> Every little area I feel like I'm missing something. It's about this time. <laughs> it's about this time. I wish I had paid more attention to the periscope. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I got a little checkpoint. Super nice of the game. Thank you, thank you. Ah, another area up there. Maybe I haven't missed the strawberry yet. Or I have. And it's okay. What happened there? <laughs> Did the honey eat my dash? Rude. Ah, a nice easy little strawberry. Not too punishing. I appreciate that. Alright, will I pay attention? Oh, that got stuck for some reason. Maybe the gears are all sticky. Well, there's another periscope there, so maybe we'll pay attention to that periscope and not this periscope. No! Wait, no! Mean! I pressed the button. <laughs> I tried. Bye. So that moved this. Oh. Oh, that's cool! So much of me playing Strawberry Jam so far is just me going, Oh. Oh. <laughs> As I discover the new things, or like what the map is asking me to do. 
It's really neat. It's a very cool feeling. Not sure about what that makes for commentary, but like, ah, oh, I'm just so stunned by how amazing this is. All right, next periscope. Is there another one further along? There is not. Do I have to pay attention to this one then? Yeah, okay, I'll try. I'll try. All right, we've got a we've got a gem. I have another dash crystal there for some reason. Somehow I want to hit this block. All right, I've got no idea. So that's cool. This is not what I wanted to do in the least. I think I've overcomplicated it. I think looking at the periscope didn't help me at all. This is totally not the way I'm supposed to do this. Not really, but it works. Oh, I'm supposed to do it this way. And then what, climb my way back up? Oh, that makes way more sense. <laughs> but I like the way I was doing it! It was silly, but it was gonna work. I mean, that was a way to do it. It worked. In the end, it was my way. And that's why I liked it. Oh, this just keeps going. Oh no. I thought I was just dealing with, like, a vertical column here. <laughs> I was wrong. We'll just, you know, we'll just uh, take it in pieces, figure it out as we go. I'm sure it'll be fine. It's gonna be okay. I don't know what's going on here. I don't like this. Now I'm over here. We've got a block underneath some molten honey, and we've got crystals above me, so don't touch those. Hmm. Well, this didn't work. So that's what it wanted. I'm not. Was it supposed to let me out like that? No, it was definitely not supposed to let me out like that. Am I supposed to go this way? What am I doing? It let me out again! <laughs> what am I doing with this? <laughs> so if I hit this and I do not bounce out, never mind, I bounced out. Alright, we try again. So if I hit this and I do not bounce out, never mind, I bounced out again. One day, I bounce out again. I wasn't ready for it that time. Okay, I got it this time. So now I do it again. Uh, um, what? Okay, what does that get me? What did I do? I would understand if it was like, I was trying to get like the momentum off of this. But I'm kind of lost. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's what I'm supposed to do! Wow, that's really cool, and also I feel like a fool. Maybe I'm supposed to do the same thing on the other side, too. That would make a lot of sense. I think I finally worked all of it through. Yes, and then... Yes, except better. Finally! <laughs> that one gave me some trouble, and admittedly most of it was my fault. That looks like a cool area, I want to be over there. I don't get to be over there, so I just have to keep going this way. Why would I want to put this back? Wait, I can't. Why would I want to do that? Oh, that makes sense. 
So I would want to put this back because if I didn't get the Dream Dash out of here, that's how I'm supposed to get up there. So here's my question. Is that true? Do I need it? Or can I just do... Can I, can I just jump up here and grab that little quarter? I bet I could do this. I did it. <laughs> yes. Was that important to do? Not in the least, but I did get some enjoyment out of it. I like to live on the edge. I like to live dangerously. <laughs> right next to the spikes. Ever since I learned how to like corner jump, I have started to fear them a lot less than I should. Oh, we found the heart. In this lovely little area where I can bounce. That was three bounces. One day. One day I'm going to get more than three. One day. One day I'm just going to get ten. Well, this is a delightful level. The music was great. The atmosphere was really cool. The mechanics were fun. And this, like, raining forest in the background is so pretty. Definitely a fantastic way to start off this episode for me. Now the question, as ever, did I miss the strawberry? I did not. There was only two. I died a lot though. Yeah, for that kind of level, I could have I could have done better. But that's not the point. The point is to have fun. Not to do better. Or like, wait, no, yes, do better, but at your own pace and something. Well that thought really got away from me. <laughs> And I'm okay with that. Look at this. It's a rose field. Oh, look at all the roses back there. Oh my gosh, look at the flowers. <laughs> oh, and they're floating by too. What is this level? I want to play it immediately. <laughs> the Rose Garden by Quinnigan. I think this is our second Quinnigan level. I'm excited to see what it has to offer. Uh, okay, right off the bat, do not touch red spikes. They are thorny. Oh, look at that rose fly by. I hope we get to ride them. <gasps> They're jellyfish. We do get to ride them. Yes. <laughs> Somehow. Oh, they work differently. And they lose petals. You get three of them. And then, oh my gosh. It's so quiet. The spikes. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh no, I needed you. All right, look. I know I said that the last level was probably going to be my favorite aesthetically, and it really is. But like, look at this one. Just look at this one! Oh, this is everything I wanted. Sans bread, of course. Oh, they're little springs! Oh, this level is fantastic! So, this is the second level in a row that kind of reminds me of a Donkey Kong Country level. I didn't say it in the last, uh, like, level, but the whole beehives, the whole, like, honey stuff, like, there, there are some levels in Donkey Kong Country that definitely have that aesthetic. And this is sort of reminding me of a really, uh, serene Bramble Blast. <laughs> You're familiar with that level at all? Okay, no? Okay. All right, we throw the flower. Try and get our flower back. So I should be able to like, do one of those, right? And then get up this way. Does the game expect me to know how to do that? I mean, it was used a lot in the farewell, to be fair. Well, but <laughs> this is also the beginner lobby. Not sure, I needed that. Oh. I'm far too delighted for this level. Like the magic of this place has me wrapped around its finger or its vine or whatever. <laughs> whatever you want to call it. Oh my gosh, and like the full, like, I don't know if that's the moon or the sun. Either way, it's very nice. Oh, the background is just so pretty. I should be watching, like, I should be watching Madeline. But I, I'm not. I'm just watching the background. Oops. That 
could not have gone any worse than that. I think that's for my safety, just in case I accidentally dashed up like I did. In which case, very nice. I appreciate that. And we're here. Oh, what a fun level. So again. Uh, I was supposed to throw the rose. <laughs> Didn't really read that in time. Throw. I don't know where you're being sent, Rose. I probably should have... Yeah, yeah. I, I figured a little too late that I should have been chasing after you. Go, go, go! <laughs> that was terrible! Oh no! Good. <laughs> Somehow we saved that. Again, again. Not sure what we're doing here, but I guess we're just gonna sneak through. But not like that. <laughs> not like that at all. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, no! <laughs> I wanna say I'm better than this, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm really not. But that's okay. For the time being, I'll just enjoy the ride. <laughs> And where I am currently. Ooh, dangerous, risky. Okay, so we throw you. Yeah, that's right. Okay, this time we throw you. Dash. I I held the button. <laughs> I did! I did hold the button! It's alright, this won't take too long. Okay, I did panic a little bit. I mean, that's a lot of my deaths in Celeste. It's just, like, uh, panic that just becomes very externalized. There. But I love this as the final ascent. Oh, that's so cool. We check the edges real fast before we get this heart. And I love how the vines are like wrapped around it. And the sun is coming down from the corner. What amazing attention to detail. What a beautiful level. I didn't find a single strawberry. <laughs> Do I get to play it again? I don't have to play it again. There are no strawberries. It was just about the adventure. I highly respect that decision. Quit again. I love this level. <laughs> I love it a lot. Right. So where does that leave us? Definitely have time for a third level. If I can find one. Okay, bench. What have we got here? Okay, it looks like there's a level directly below me. So maybe I should head back that way. Yeah, that checks out. Alright, let's go to whatever is directly below me. One day. <laughs> Stop fighting me! There should be one over here. And indeed, there is something. Oh, I don't know about this. <laughs> this has a very wildly different aesthetic from the last two levels I just played. Potential for Anything by Bean Jimin and Frozen Flygon. You know what? It's the potential for anything. Maybe it's also the potential for a good time. And it's got a V. <laughs> what does that mean? Is this like that game that's like V V V V V? Is that the idea? Doesn't that game also involve like gravity shenanigans? I think it does. Never actually played it before. Is are we being welcomed to Victor Fourth Space Station or v v Victor Six Space Station? I have a feeling. Wait, hang on. <laughs> Roman numerals. I have a feeling it's six. 
And then that what? Because like how many V's are in VVV? How do you even search this? V, 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 v. How do you even search this game? <laughs> okay, there are six in VVV. And I am in fact looking at the Roman numeral for six. Okay, so there's actually now seven V's because of Victor. <laughs> what do you think of that game? Our gravity stabilizers are currently experiencing technical difficulties. We apologize for the inconvenience. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, what is this? <laughs> it's like our spiky friends, but instead they're like pulsing and um, very threatening. Yeah. Yeah, I did not react to that whatsoever. And now I'm on the ceiling. So that means I'm dashing directly down now? Is that how that works? Yes. Oh no, wait, are the controls only flipped vertically and not left to right? That is true, they are only flipped vertically. Actually, they're not even really flipped. But my intuition is flipped. I... Hello, upside down periscope. I'm not sure about this. <laughs> I am a little hesitant. Jumped right into that. It's funny how just one little tweak like this really messes with your brain. I don't even really think it needs to be as difficult as I'm making it. But again, that's all it takes. So, so dear. And should have seen that coming. Don't do it. Now do it. I am so in trouble with this level. Why? It's like I have an inability to avoid them. It's very odd. Uh huh. Potential for anything for sure. Why did I do that? <laughs> okay. Ah. <laughs> ah. Uh, uh, are you okay? V, 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 V. So I'll be doing this and then following my way back. <laughs> I just need slightly better uh, decision making. For sure. And then we go back. And there's the strawberry. Not too bad. All right, we're going down. What is up with this? What are you about to do to me? I was really afraid it was about to crush me. What's with all these little... Uh, uh, nothing, apparently. Level complete? Are, is that... Are you being sincere? Is the level complete? It's not complete. You are not being sincere. I guess there's multiple levels within this stage. So I might want to pick up the pace. If I can jump correctly. Ooh, a television. Hello. This is a test of the hub console system. We don't have anything funny to say at this time. Please come back later. Okay. I feel like I'm missing a lot of the jokes because I've never actually played VVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVVV
Should I be dashing? Yes. I really should be dashing. No! Is this right? Do I go this way? Oh, it's, it's still a maze. <laughs> it's still a maze. Uh-huh. And this lets me go over here, which then lets me go over here. And I have the gravity flip the right way, so I could do this. And then regret. Okay, let's just climb. There. That was a little safer. I should probably get Madeline out of here. Not like that. So we just do this again. And then I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but I mean, I know how to neutral jump really good. So. Uh, hello, Strawberry. I'm s a little worried. I think I see. Okay, well, I didn't see that coming, but I do get the idea. No! So, come on! To anyone watching in the comments who cares to comment, and if you've played VVVVV before, because I'm guessing this is what it's from, what, what does that mean? What is the 25 and 32? What's that about? Is that a joke that's explainable? Or do you just kind of have to play the game to get it? I got the strawberry. <laughs> I might not get the joke, but I got the strawberry. Where does this put me? Puts me here. Oh, and then I get it. This. And this. And now we fall forever. All right, that's one more of those blocks down. Something something level complete. Woo! So now I just need to get one more block out of the way. Here. What did I just touch? What did this just do? I mean, that's fair. Oh. So, I need to do this while I'm already falling. I think. Or uh, the other way. Like, this way. That makes sense. Warning! Passing completely through white particle grating may remove dash. Oh, it did. It did do that. I just noticed. Now you tell me. All right, <laughs> so that's what this level's turned into. Oh no, oh no. There's no way I'm not gonna touch all of these. I could not believe I just got away with that. <laughs> I can't believe I just did that. Okay. Just keep the momentum and it should be okay. Don't do that. Wait, which way do I wanna go? This way looks harder. I might be wrong. Uh-oh, 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 no, please! Please let me go back down! No, wait, 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 take me back, take me back! <laughs> Give me this! So that was, that was nice, to stumble into that strawberry! <laughs> Okay, back on track, and don't know what's going on here, just, just, okay, you cannot just hold forward. It's gonna get more complicated than that. Oh, I'm not good at this whatsoever. Okay, go forward, and go there. I think I'm good? Do I want to be on the ceiling? I guess being on the ceiling's okay. And... Now I'm not on the ceiling anymore, so that's okay, too! Why? Why would... Why? <laughs> Wait, why? <laughs> oh. I missed the obvious gap there. <laughs> there we are. 
Uh huh. And we'll just grab the last token. And get the heck out of here. Oh, and it gives me my dash back because, uh, you know, <laughs> you kind of need it. Now, if I just reverse the gravity one last time, I should be able to get to what might be the actual end of this level. I was wrong. <laughs> I was very wrong. Oh dear, there are a lot of moving pieces to this, and I do mean that quite literally. Be mean? Wait, no. <laughs> the opposite? <laughs> Why do I keep saying the opposite of what I mean this episode? Uh, be kind to me. <laughs> Please be kind to me. Please let me back. And then gravity again. Cool. Where are we going? Are we done yet? This looks like we're done. I'm falling forever. Let's just grab that. <laughs> Stop falling forever. Woo, okay. That's a three levels down. Unless I missed anything. I did not. <laughs> Great. Let's take a look. More stickers. The arrow is breaking through the television. That's pretty cute. Obviously the rose. And the tree stump with honey. Oh, great stickers. And yes, I am. I am missing a beginner level. Wherever this seeing is believing is, I'll find you eventually. But <laughs> before I take too close a look at that book, I obviously need to go pick a level to do Deathless. Ah, uh, yes, here we are. I think this one will be really fun to do Deathless. Normally, I like to pick the level that gave me the most trouble in the episode, or at least that's what I've been doing the last two times. But I think I'm going to be kind to myself, give myself a treat, and do one that just I think is going to be really fun to put it all together. <laughs> I hope that's not a sign of things to come. I am definitely going to mess up many sections of this, so I shouldn't get too attached to any particular run just yet. A lot of this is just going to be me relearning exactly what the level looks like. Yep. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's it's going to be a bit of this. Wait, no, I forgot you. Come back. Grab the rose. <laughs> Make a mistake. Get a new rose. <laughs> we can have more roses. <laughs> How many more roses? Probably only just the one, right? Because like if I take this and I do this, it's just going to reset the screen. Yeah. Fair enough. I suppose there's a world in which you uh probably could use that for some cheese. But I think today I just want to enjoy the ride. Oh, I love music like this. This, like, upbeat, adventurous kind of music. I cannot wait to pick up the soundtrack for this mod. Another thing I've been listening to a lot lately is the soundtrack for Chicory, A Colorful Tale. Uh, I've never played the game, but I picked it up because of, you know, how amazing Celeste's music was. And I've just been listening to that album on repeat. It's been very calming, very peaceful. Oh. Alright, back here again, and this time... This time, I messed up a little bit, but it's okay so far. Yeah, this nice sea block keeps me from bonking my head against the, the thorns. Very much appreciated that. And up we go. And we're good. Do not remember what this screen entails, so... Why did I do that? Well, it's been about a week since I last saw this level. I started this entire recording before I left on vacation. So I just got back yesterday and I got frustrated. I spent about 40 minutes and just uh, my, my finger was starting to hurt. <laughs> Holding down the, the grab button was uh, doing that to me. 
So, I took a break, and quite a long one. <laughs> so now I need to get sort of back into the flow in this and remember what this level's asking of me. Anyway, I had a wonderful time. <laughs> I did I did drive 11 hours yesterday. So, is this the right mindset to be doing these attempts? I don't know, but here I am. Still, I'm glad to be back at this, attempting it. This level is, after all, absolutely amazing and gorgeous. And I love the music. <laughs> Happy to be here. Get the dash and wave dash and then hold back because don't want to go into those thorns. Throw the rose. Oh, well, that's a new one. <laughs> I don't think I've ever managed to do that one before. Hmm. Let me through. <laughs> Just let me through anyway. No. Grab the berry. Grab the rose, and up we go. As the music starts to get really inspiring and starts to swell, so too do my spirits. As we soar on the breeze, our lovely rose-scented companion in hands. Um, something something, uh, the hope of love will blossom. <laughs> sure, let's go with that. I would be a terrible terrible author. I've actually done a lot of creative writing throughout the years, but that doesn't mean I'm good at it. It just was something to do. Something to pass the time. Fun ways to, uh, you know, express my creativity. Although, of course, finding the right words was always a challenge. <laughs> and that hasn't changed. Woo! <gasps> I went too slow there. I didn't know I could do that. Okay, there it is. First time I've made it back here. Well, you know, since I took a break. Oh. Well, I'll get it eventually. I just need to focus, right? I just need to focus. And by focus, I mean not focus. I think I need to ramble. Because sometimes the best kind of focusing is when you don't focus. <laughs> uh, let's see. Well, like I said, earlier this week I went on vacation. And I had a really lovely and relaxing time. I got to hang out with friends who I hadn't seen in a while. And other than the part where I drove for 11 hours... Uh, that part was less fun. <laughs> other than that part, it was great. Uh, one day we went window shopping, which was super fun. And I ended up in a mall at one point. That was interesting. Uh, I think the best, though, was just like the times where we hung out, we watched a movie, or played board games, or uh, Magic the Gathering. I was super excited to be able to play that with my friends. And yeah, I just had a really nice time. Uh, another thing I got to do while I was down there... Uh, <laughs> And this is a bit weird for me, to be honest with you, is I read through 14 volumes of Chainsaw Man. Uh, <laughs> I would not have described that story as something that I would have been interested to pick up. I've, I've heard good things about it, but it's not typically my kind of story. It's pretty bloody, it's pretty gory, the characters are pretty messy, although given the, like, I guess the nature of the story they're telling, that's pretty forgivable. Characters can be messy. Uh, yeah, it just surprised me that I was into it enough to read 14 volumes of it. So I guess I enjoyed it. <laughs> I must have enjoyed it. I wouldn't have read 14 volumes otherwise. Uh, do I like it, though? Like, I don't know. I don't know. I will probably continue to read it. Uh, I thought parts of the story were really clever, and the, like, the attention and the dramatic, like, irony, I guess, if that's the right term, uh, was pretty good. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm still scared of this section. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> I saved it. I saved it. Um, Kobeni is the best character, though. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll die on that hill. 
All right, can I get this? I want to do this. <laughs> oh, wow. Almost hit that, but made it out. And is this the last screen? I think this is it. I think I made it. As long as I don't do anything bad here. I did it! Yes! <laughs> Let's grab that heart. I did grab the berry at the beginning, right? I didn't forget the berry. Did I forget the berry? <laughs> I can't remember! Wait, did I get the berry? <laughs> yes, I did. I got the silver platinum something berry. Yes! <laughs> cool. I don't know how many extra deaths that took me, but it took me quite a bit. I spent 40 minutes working on this before I left. And then I sat down 34 minutes ago, so yeah, like a little over an hour to get this berry, but that's okay. The challenge was well worth it. The level was beautiful. The music was great. Uh, Quinnigan and everyone else who worked on this level, I absolutely adored it. Thank you so much. It was wonderful and I need to go find a logbook so I can end today's episode. Oh no, I'm stuck. I live here now. Okay, had to come all the way over here for this. I am still ever so lost in this lobby. Uh, here are all our wonderful stickers. I don't think I showed this off last week, but then again, who knows? That's the problem with taking a break in the middle of a recording. Ah, there it is, the Rose Garden. We have our silver berry for that. And that's the only berry in the entire map. Again, I really love the fact that that thing had zero strawberries throughout it, and it was just its own adventure. I appreciated that. Though I will say, I also appreciated Treehive, just for his aesthetics. And potential for anything sure did give me a bit of a runaround, which, you know, that's a fun experience too. So thank you both for that. But let's pack it up for today. Where am I going to end today's episode? That's a level I've never seen before. That's cool. That's not where I'm going to end today's episode. I can't end a level or an episode in a level that I haven't seen yet. Where am I? <laughs> How do I get lost every time? Well, this is, I haven't gone this way either. <laughs> wait, in, in here too? No, wait, I've been here. This is potential. <laughs> I found you. I found a level. Okay, great. We're ending today's, we're ending today's episode here. All right, everyone, if you made it this far into the video, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Also, this is really weird. Hold on. Let me let me change gravity back. There we go. That's better. Uh, seriously, though, uh, everyone who's been watching my videos lately and who've given me a chance and clicked on them. Thank you so much. Uh, the overwhelming support that I've been getting recently has been amazing. And I hope I'm able to continue making videos that, you know, make you smile. Uh, but, uh, that's future March's problem. Right? Is that how that works? Is making you smile her problem, my problem, all of our problems? Hmm. Uh, you know what? I'll give that one some more thought. Alright, everyone, until I see you next. Bye!